It's a historic day in the world of space exploration for all of us. China's lunar probe Chang'e 4 has finally landed safely on the dark side of the moon, which has remained unexplored till now. The first images of the far side of the moon were sent back by the probe with the help of a relay satellite called Kuikiao. The satellite was put in place by the China National Space Administration back in May 2018. Taking a hard stand against the problems of fake news and child pornography, the Indian government is reportedly planning to amend IT laws in the country to completely shut down any app or website responsible for spreading fake stories and child pornography. The central government is asking for amendments in the IT Act to include provisions for penalizing and taking down apps and websites that are unable to control fake news and child porn. Platforms like Facebook, WhatsApp, Google, Twitter, Telegram and Snapchat could get impacted adversely if these amendments are put in place, as the government will then have the power to limit public access to these services. Xiaomi and Redmi have split up. Well, not really, but Redmi will now be the sub-brand of Xiaomi just like Poco. The CEO of the company announced today that the decision of making the brand an independent entity is to focus on the Mi brand of phones and generate more business from that segment. After this split, Xiaomi will have three brands under it. Redmi for budget phones, Poco for affordable premium phones, and Mi for premium phones. Expanding its feature phone portfolio, HMD Global has announced the Nokia 106 at a price of 1299 rupees. The device gets a battery that is claimed to deliver up to 15.7 hours of talk time and up to 21 days of standby time. The company says that it has carefully considered spacing between each button on the key mat so that it makes it easy to dial and text. The phone also features the Snake Xenia game and the phone book can store up to 2000 contacts. The phone also has an LED torch, inbuilt FM radio and the ability to store up to 500 messages. The Nokia 106 comes in dark grey and is available across top mobile retailers in the country as well as on Nokia.com. Xiaomi has introduced a new product in India in the form of its Mi Air Pop PM2.5 anti-pollution mask. Xiaomi Mi Air Pop PM2.5 anti-pollution mask is black in colour and comes fitted with four layers of filters. The primary layer on the mask blocks out large particles. The next is a layer of mesh followed by an electrostatic microfiltration layer to block out particles smaller than 0.3 micrometer. Lastly, there is a water permeable layer to reduce vapour buildup. Using this four-layer filtration system, the Mi Air Pop is set to filter out 99% of impurities in the air. For the latest technology updates, subscribe to Digit.in and don't forget to hit the bell icon.